Welcome to another mega exciting five minute auto bearing. Okay, let's try and keep it exciting as promised. Smith Mora, is he accepting it? Nope. Play Bishop D3 line, surprise. <laughs> it's got some venom for five minute, I think. 97 E6. We've got a different sort of position to the normal. Alkine defense maneuver. Hmm. Is F3 threatened to win a piece? If I play H4, am I threatening F3 on knight G3? He's got a check. I'm trying to trap this knight. Alright, knight E2, I'm threatening maybe F3 now without knight G3. A bit naughty idea. <laughs> uh, it's, not, it's not happening now. G3 or H5. Maybe H5 is more subtle about things. Don't want to play. Oh, no, giving him the G5 square. G3 was the way to do it. Oh, Muppets. Oh, no night trap. <laughs> Form pawn. This knight out of here anyway. I'm just allowed Bishop H4, haven't I? Oh man. I'm be losing a pawn. I play G3 after that. I'm losing a pawn. Oh, the knight's useful. Oh, oh. <laughs> Check. Oh dear. I've actually justified the knight. Congratulations to me. I've justified the knight. Check. On E4. The well, knight's kind of trapped there, though, isn't it? The way he's played it. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, we have an interesting possession. Why don't I just take that and then F4? Or even here, just take and then F4. It's king still in the sense there's knight e7, I suppose. Can I play knight c3? He's after a pawn over here now. What have I done to this guy? He's after my, all my pawns. I'm uh, taking on b2. It's going to go around here to g2. Oh, crikey, that is the plan. Oh, my god. Oh my goodness. Well, I can play the rook h5, and I've got knight b5 to d6. All right, so this this is getting interesting. I, I'll play the ideas out. I don't want the knight helping the queen. So queen g2. All right, I'll, I'll play the knight d6 first. My, my rook's kind of stranded anyway. And this is bishop f1. Hang on, can I evict this queen with bishop f1? It's not so clear cut there, is it? I get to play knight d6 if I want. And f4. Um, let's see. Uh, queen b2, rook b1. Can we get this queen out, get this queen out of my hair? He hasn't really developed any pieces. I'm sure he deserves to be punished. Okay, where is the king going? I'm, I'm going to snap this guy off and play f4 soon. If he's not careful, on the bishop e7 to think about. The queen's actually a right pain in the ass. Oh, sorry, did I say that out loud? <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, is there knight c8 for? <laughs> oh man, <laughs> um, Poland French. Uh, okay, if, if I just take on h5 for a moment and then bishop e2. 
or, or can I use that rook around here? Bishop g1, rook h2, swing it around there. That's nifty. Instead of losing the exchange, it's novel. Knight f4, rook h2. Oh, this is crazy. I want to transfer the rook over here. Crazy idea. Instead of sacking the exchange. Because actually, I, I want to target b7 anyway and have Jack. both rooks working together. Comrade. Comrade rooks. Oh, there's knight f4. Oh no. I think I have to snap this guy off. Let's come to that to protect d4. Is there a rook b3? I can't get this queen out of my, my position. Is there, is there any time a way of evicting this queen? Rook b3. Alright, alright. There's bishop e1. There's bishop h4. This pawn, pawn is going to be dangerous soon. As unfortunately, there's a weakness of the last move there. And here, yeah, it seems. I don't trust this position. There's f4 and stuff. Bishop f2, f4, for example, wins. That, that queen is a total pain, I've got to say. Check. Uh, yep. Check. 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 Oh man. Everything's gone. It's all gone. It's a bit sad, I gotta say. I've all had stuff earlier. It's, I've been trashed. I've been trashed. Ah, the queen the queen is just such a pain. But I, and I'm not sure uh, let's have a look then. Which one is mentioned? If I go with this, if I ever try and trap the knight, there's all sorts of possibilities. Check, check. Yeah, it's just really annoying. Um, check. Um, Bishop D two apparently. I wonder what the idea is. Uh, say yeah. Uh, oh, to just trap the queen like that, yeah. Oh, Bishop d2. I find something suspect about it. So now it's holding d4 here. Wow. Check. Well, it was it was nearly all over. Bishop d2. Check. And again, I missed Bishop d2. Ah. Uh. Check. Yeah, I, it's. Hmm. I don't think this is any good. Check, check, check. And it's carnage after that. All right, so I have to be very careful. The bishop d2 move. Let's have a quick look at that again. Why is that so powerful again? I mean, it stops things like. Bishop. Um, Let's see. It stops Queen A five. So I'm actually it's like boiling the frog over the Queen, uh, taking away all the escape squares of the Queen. I'm gonna boil this 
frog uh, as knight d6 on queen a6 so rook a1 is basically it's checkmating the queen it's such a brilliant position what does it do give up the knight oh i missed checkmating the queen <laughs> oh man oh okay if you don't checkmate the queen the queen does damage comments questions appreciate thanks very much